looking for an enchanting place, search no more. Asuka Wild Restaurant has a fairy tale journey waiting for us inside. Let's go. I am flabbergasted. Is that even an English word? Listen. I'm flabbergasted, yes I it is. I am mesmerized with this place. Mm -hmm. What are you guys doing here? Oh, uh, we're going crazy. <laughs> For sure. We're going crazy, <laughs> and uh, life is short, okay? So uh, being that, first of all, we designed, uh, this bar opened in 2017, okay. and already with the antiques and photos and everything like that is already crazy on its own. And then every season we tend to do something up for the holidays, for Lunar New Year, Chinese New Year, Valentine's Day, and now for the summer we did this whole Alice in Wonderland thing where we're we were really going down the rabbit hole, you know? know. Pun very much intended, you know? <laughs> Chris, I'm mm? feeling a little bit out of place. Really? I know. Hmm, what can we do? I don't know, Luke, I'm wearing black and white and there's such a colorful place in here. Let's fix that. Yeah? Oh, oh my God, you're a magician? Chris, yes. now that I am properly dressed yes. for this incredible location, why don't you walk me over to maybe a few spots that are more like Instagrammable? So we are at the whiskey bar. Oh. And this right here is an old organ out of an Austrian church. We have over 350 whiskeys and cocktails, of course, okay. wine, beer, everything else. But uh, this actually is a heart of Oscar Wilde when it comes to the bar. You know, I love the fact that you guys do have like a super long bar and, and this is like so much fun and everything. But people can actually come here and have a full sit down yes. brunch or dinner. What did you bring out for us? We brought some Mediterranean octopus uh -huh. with chimichurri on the bottom and some fingerling potatoes cut, mm. right? Then we have arancini stuffed with truffles and rice. Arancinis are usually so heavy. Yeah, this is actually this very, one is light. very light. very mm light. -hmm. Then we have a classic buffalo cauliflower. I've never had this before. This is so good. And then lastly, we have something from the old country, good old fish and chips. I love how fish and chips always just gives you that comfort. <laughs> you said comfort it, yeah. Food. <laughs> Total comfort food. Yeah, definitely. Mm. So here we got the Helena Maloney. So we have Tanteo Habanero Tequila, Aperol, which kind of balances a little bit. And then to give it a little bit uh, more personality, uh, we use canola passion fruit. Now I am having the James Dean. It's one of our smoked old fashions. So it's made with Templeton rye, a little uh, peach liqueur, Amaro Nonino, and a little cinnamon. So I'm going to toast to you. Thank you so much. And thanks for coming by. Thank you. Salute. I toast to you guys. Salute. Cheers.